Hi all, welcome to the Salesforce Ultimate Guide channel. In this video, we are going to start with our next trigger scenario. Trigger intro question number 32. If an opportunity is closed, then no one should be able to delete it except the user having a system administrator profile. Okay, so if we want to see it on the UI, I will go to my org. So uh, first, I will disable all of my FX triggers running here. Okay, uh, there is one more active one. I will disable that. Yeah, right now all the uh, active Apex triggers are disabled. And then if we go to the UI, so there are like opportunities. The opportunity may be having closed lost or closed one. So both of these are called as closed opportunities. And if I try to delete now, so right now, as a system admin, I should be able to delete it. <clears throat> Sorry, uh, right now I have logged in as another user. So that time we should throw error that you cannot delete the opportunity. So this is the use case we want to implement, okay? So for that purpose, uh, we will uh, just log in with uh, the system admin. Then we are going to write a trigger for the same. So, this uh, this is uh, in case of delete trigger. So first I will close all okay. the existing triggers here. Just for keep, keeping it simple. Okay. Then I will create a new Apex trigger. Opportunity trigger 32. That should run on the opportunity object because uh, that is the uh, our interested object right now okay and the event is it's like before delete because it has to run only in the delete scenario so we are going to run it on before delete okay so after this we are just going to uh, check whether, whether it is triggered or is before and triggered dot is delete so only if this particular condition matches, then only it has to go further. <clears throat> then as usual, we will iterate through all the uh, modified records. So if opportunity OPP on trigger dot word, because in the delete scenario, no, we should be operating on trigger dot word records. Okay. The very next condition will be need to check whether the opportunity is closed or not. So first I will open a opportunity object. Okay. So on the opportunity we have stage name. Okay. This stage name if opportunity dot stage name is equal to equal to closed one because what are the values we have if you go to any of the opportunity it's either closed lost <clears throat> it is either closed lost or closed one okay so for that why uh, that's purpose i am writing it like that closed one either it should be matching with this or it should match with the closed lost opportunity dot stage name is equal to equal to closed lost okay then once this condition matches right further we need to check whether the uh, profile profile check we need to make to make that profile check first i will query profile p is equal to select so if you open any of the profile object now file dot object id and name if you query right in the name we have system administrator okay 
So that's why I am just querying mm -hmm. here select ID front profile where name is equal to so name is equal to system administrator. Only this person can be able to delete it. Okay. <clears throat> so we got the profile. Then if Apache stage name is matching with this and if uh user info so the current logged in user user info dot get profile id so we, we will be able to get this profile id so whether it is a system admin or is a general user like that it should not matching with the admin system administrator so that's why like i will compare it with p dot id so whatever the profile record we got from that id we are going to match it with this if both are not equal then we should show the error so for showing the error first dot add error so only system administrators can delete closed opportunity so this is the error we want to throw it uh, so our trigger is ready now. Now we will go and test it. So right now I have logged in as system administrator. I have an opacity. I will try to delete on opacity with the close lost status. Delete. Delete. Yeah, as a system admin, I am able to delete it. If I go to setup. And for the users, user test. So I will log in with a different user who is having a name as system admin clone is the profile name. So I log in it with this particular user. If I go to any of the opportunities, okay, this is one of the close one opportunity. And if I click on try to delete it, so we will get an error that only system administrator can delete closed opacity. So uh, I think this was a very good uh, trigger and it was very, very easy and simple one. I think you guys have understood it. So uh, please uh, practice the same on your org as well. Please like and comment on the video if you guys have liked this video. Thank you so much.